Hello, and welcome to the Theodore Roosevelt inaugural National Historic Site. My name is Stanton Hudson, and I'm the executive director of this Historic House Museum. We're very glad to have you here today and to tell you a little something about why this house is important, not only to Buffalonians and Western New Yorkers, but to the nation as a whole. It is the location where Theodore Roosevelt took the oath of office on September 14th, 1901, to become the country's 26th president of the United States. This site is one of only four places in American history where the presidential oath of office was administered outside the nation's capital. It is also Western New York's only National Park Service site. Now, having said that, you may think, well, they must get all of their dollars from the federal government. Unfortunately, that's not true. We are unlike any other park in the entire country in that the management, the maintenance, the operations, the planning and the interpretation of this site are all administered by a volunteer board of trustees comprised of community leaders from Buffalo and throughout Western New York. We are charged on an annual basis to raise approximately 60% of all of our dollars here locally. And thanks to the generosity of Western New Yorkers, both individuals and corporations, we have been successful at doing just that for the past 48 years. Among the ways in which we raise funds here at the site is holding special events. One of our largest single events is our anniversary and awards dinner, which this year is going to be held on Thursday, September 19th, the atrium at Rich's starting at 6 p.m. On Thursday, September 19th, we will be honoring two outstanding Western New Yorkers with the site's Exemplary Citizenship and Service Award. Those two individuals are Scott Beeler and Kathy Lasher, who have done wonderful things throughout the community for many years and are going to be honored as a result of their numerous contributions to making our community a better place to live. In addition, we will also be honoring with our President's Award, the Junior League of Buffalo, on the occasion of its 100th anniversary in 2019. Anyone interested in the purchase of tickets for our anniversary and awards dinner can uh, access this website. For further information on the dinner, please feel free to call us at 884-0095 here at the Theodore Roosevelt site.